start live uh, chat live chat before people yell at me <laughs> they will too i know they will what's going on divers this is jacob from the chaos divers i have ronnie from brothers underwater recovery with me today hi guys we are going to wait for some people to come in i do see that there's 99 people in here and that means the world to us um, your support means everything i will say um, i want to give special thanks to every each and every one of you guys for coming in to talk about what we're fixing to talk about now i was i wasn't going to do this live stream this evening but in the kathy had gotten a hold of me and you know had told me that it was okay if I did this. Um, it has been put on the, um... The perfect sleeper is made with a unique hex cloud foam designed to cradle your body and help provide relief. <laughs> it has... Turn it down. I know. I was waiting. All right, there we go. <laughs> it has been brought out uh, in, to the public that Patrick Ream was recovered from the Rock River yesterday uh, around, was it 8 p.m.? It's around 8 p.m. Like by... <clears throat> the Lee, was it Lee County? Lee County Sheriff's Department. Lee County Sheriff's Department. And Dixon Royal Fire. Royal Fire. I want to personally say thank you to Lee County and Dixon Royal for recovering Patrick. Absolutely. Um, the details are still not all out there, but I do want to say thanks to everyone who searched like North Star um, Search and Recovery. You guys are amazing. Um, Brothers Underwater Recovery for helping me on the dives. I want to say special thanks to Southern Illinois Search Team, Lindsay, and Casey, and David. Thank you guys for helping. You know, we had um, Wings of Hope, Mike, and Brad. Thank you so much and everybody in the search teams and all the volunteers who have came out to try to help bring Patrick home. You know, we, we, fit, we found out where he was not. Yeah. And, and I'm just, I'm thanking God every day that he has been brought home to Kathy because she needed closure. She needed to find Patrick. Patrick was located about 50 to 55 miles on the Rock River, south of the bridge that we were searching. So with that, we've gathered information and we've learned from this that, you know, even, even though that may have been the point of entry, he could be 60 miles, you know, 100 miles down river. And, you know, at least we knew where he wasn't. No, yeah, because that river was shallow in spots and it was moving. Very. I mean, it was it, it was getting it. So it was a very difficult thing for for us to leave Kathy not knowing where he was. Um, with that being said, guys, Kathy um, does have a GoFundMe put out there for funeral costs. Uh, you know, to bring Patrick home, to have you know the support you guys have shown us throughout this has been amazing. And this is the reason why we bring it to you guys because the support system out here is, you know, you guys are just amazing to help us and to provide us with what we need to do the job. And I wanna take this time, if Lindsay or one of the other mods would put out um, Kathy's GoFundMe that will go to helping bring Patrick home to a nice resting place um, and and to help Kathy with with expenses to do what she needs to do with it. So uh, Lindsay Buzik has um, put in the GoFundMe um, link. So thank so you about up that. Through there a few times. Has it? Yeah. Thank you guys for all that. Um, you know the prayers got answered. I told Kathy. We've told Kathy that you know, if we don't bring him home that weekend, we hope he gets found, and he was. 
so that's that's the main thing that that's the goal is to bring answers to the family and by bringing this out to you guys you never know like when we when we tell you guys about these cases that we're working on it's it's not to to capitalize on things it's asking for help it's to get awareness out. it's to get it's to get awareness out to you guys heck you guys might go out Sir, we may be searching at Kentucky Lake for an individual, and then you come out the next weekend. Keep your eyes out. That's Picnic what we and fishing. You know, just having a good time with your family, and you stumble upon something like that. Yeah. You know, it's it. That's the reason why we do what we do. You know, we try to bring bring them home, and you know, we do everything in our powers to do that. So. Thank you guys again. We really appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you for the respect in the chats. Um, if it's irrelevant to this um, certain case, please keep the comments to a minimum um, for respect for Kathy. Um, and what I want you guys to do, um, if you will, give Kathy some space. Please let her have time to grieve have time to grieve have time to heal and you know you can shower her with some love on her on her on her text but please don't try to personally get a hold of her she needs time her family needs time and you know she's she's gonna she's gonna get better it's just gonna take some time and also with that being said um, just Riverside Riverview or Riverside <laughs> Riverview Inns and Suites I've said this before they were very humble to us and gracious to us to provide us a place to stay while we searched so thank you so much for that if you guys are in the thank Rockford you if you guys are in the Rockford area it's a beautiful hotel go and stay there or send them a message on Facebook or their website saying thank you for what you guys have done for Kathy that's amazing. I just now got a notification. Mine got it two minutes after we went. I was live. just. I just now got a notification that I'm going live. All right, great. <laughs> um, I do apologize for not paying attention to the chat. I do want to get that out there. Um, Sky Dancer. So Patrick Green was recovered about 50 miles south of where we were searching, and he was able to um, be brought home. They were, he was identified yesterday, or was it today? The autopsy came out today, yeah. Yeah, and, and Kathy was, um, Kathy was notified. I couldn't even think of that word of him. So, and Kathy got a hold of me and told me that it was okay for me to come on here, for us to come on here and to bring awareness to this, you know, guys just, yeah, because we wouldn't do this without her Her okay. Yeah. Yeah, and, you know, as it was put out there in the public abruptly like that, you know, I'm not going to mention anybody's name, but it's okay. You know, um, we just want, <clears throat> we want to be able to provide and, and help out Kathy as much as we can to deter the cost of, of putting Patrick to rest. You know, it's, everybody knows how much it costs to do that. Um, and to try to help her out would be amazing. It would be, you know, I know Brothers Underwater Recovery would appreciate it, I would appreciate Absolutely. it. I know Southern Illinois Search Team, everybody who was involved. We all love Kathy and we're glad that Patrick is finally home. Um, we do ask for the respect of showering her with some love, but please don't try to directly contact her for right now until she's ready. Um, also, instead of a like spike, I, I, instead of a, uh, a viewer spike, I want you guys to fill this chat up with hearts, prayers, everything for the family of Patrick. So on the countdown from five, I want you guys to put in the emojis to show Kathy that 
us here at YouTube, us here on Facebook, if you're watching this on Facebook, we all care about Kathy and we're glad that he's home. So five, four, three, two, one. Go guys. And at this time, we're going to give a moment of silence for Patrick. Look at all that. Look at that. Oh, wow. That is just... You guys are awesome. That is awesome. I can't stop scrolling <laughs> here. I can't... There's not even any words in here. It's all hearts and emojis and all kinds That's of... That's awesome. All kinds of great stuff. Look at all that. Thank you so much, guys. Good night. I can't get back <laughs> to the chat. Still going. <laughs> Thank you, guys. I can't check the chat now because there's too many hearts and prayers. And we love you, Kathy, and uh, we're there for you. There's, this is a really, really tight community here on YouTube. There's, there's families that we have helped that are on our community page that can reach out to you and um, you know help you with the healing process. So. Do you want to add anything? Have I forgot anything? I'd just like to thank Kathy for the opportunity to come down and help search, you know. What? Come up. No, come up. Oh, come up. <laughs> yeah, it is up, ain't it? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. No, it's good. I'm just, yeah. I was just giving you. <laughs> Go ahead. The opportunity to come up and help search, you know, for your son, it, it meant the world to me. Um, I'm glad he's coming home and he's found and you can lay him to the rest and be able to know where he's at now. So thank you for that. Answers is, is something that we thrive to give and when we can, it hurts, but at least now you have answers. Um, thank you guys for co committing searches. You're welcome. That's what we do. Um, with that being said, I don't think there's anything else that, that I can think of. Um, if anybody does, now I'm just going to throw this out there. If anybody does, um, donate to the cause on the GoFundMe and or the folks who know my PayPal, um, for the folks who know my PayPal, if you send any donations, please put for Kathy or, you know, for Patrick on there so I can, you know, go through and give Kathy what needs to be sent to her that you guys have shared. Um, Lindsay Buzik, um, she's been an amazing help on the channel. She's been an amazing help on the website. Um, and in searches and in so yeah <laughs> yeah sorry yeah. she's been in a, so that should have been said first um the southern illinois search team is a fantastic group please check them out on facebook please check out wings of hope on facebook please check out north star on facebook brothers underwater recovery on youtube so that north stars search and recovery um did i forget anybody search and rescue search and rescue um, so Lindsay put on here on behalf of CIST, which is Southern Illinois search team. Thank you for allowing us to be a part of this tremendous humbling experience. Love you all. Um, so please get a hold of them. You know, as much as I hate to say this, there's still a lot of missing people out there that we are trying to help. Um, I, it would be an honor for me. It would be an honor for Ronnie. If you guys would come help and assist us, go through Wings of Hope if you're up in Wisconsin. I think it's in Wisconsin, I think. Mm -hmm. In Wisconsin, um, get a hold of Southern Illinois Search Team here and uh, help us out. 
I know that <clears throat> Terry helped us out. Good night did she ever help us out. Like she was there from daylight till dark. Terry yes, she was. Sp sp spritz. Spritz, yeah. And then Ringo and Czar, Kyle. Yep. And his son, Cody. Went out in their boat, searched islands and the waterways and I and and for those who showed up but was too shy to come and say hi to us that was said it was <laughs> <clears throat> please know that we're always open to anybody to come up to us to talk to us you know we're just normal people yeah we may have YouTube and whatever but we're just normal people and when I looked up there and asked for help on searching, I seen a line out to the road of searchers coming there. I wasn't able to say hi because I was doing, we were in the process of getting ready to get out in the water. But I want to say thank you for all those who came out to try to help. With that being said, keep diving guys. Is there, or is, is there something else you need to add or anything? Thank them all for have coming we, out to help. And Have we covered? I yep. believe so. All right. I love we, you guys. We do our best. You know, everything we do, we, we try our hardest. And there's a lot of other groups out there that are trying to. So, you know. Just give them a chance. Give them a chance. Get a hold of us. Love you guys. Keep diving. It's not worth it to stop, which means keep pushing in life. You know, if you fail, keep going, keep pushing, and don't ever give up. And until next time, stick with us. Love you guys. Y'all have a nice evening. Thank you again.